This show is sponsored by PrintByMagic.com. We print directly to your bicycle playing card. Hello and welcome to the Magic World Review Show. I am James Anthony and this is Review Show 92. We are climbing up the ladder really, really quick and almost reaching that 100 where we're going to do an amazing special offer. But have we got a review show for you today? When we say we, you know that means just me today. However, we have one epic, epic review show. Just in terms of the products that are being reviewed, uh, mostly. That's all I'm going to say, mostly. Today, we're going to be reviewing three products. We're going to be reviewing Murray Mint, which I'll tell you a lot about this. We're going to save this to the end because it is a very, very super exciting product. And it's on pre-order. It's not even available yet, but it will be very, very soon. So that is Murray Mint. Then we have Narcissus by Chris Philpott. This uh, is a fun sort of product. Definitely looking forward to giving you a few ideas on this. And also Deceive, which you guys asked for last week from Sans Minds. So, yep, a visual colour change in the spectator's hand. So, once we've done the review show, there'll be no competition this week. Just simply a good, solid review show. We're still getting ready to move offices. It's still not started yet. And I'll give you a little bit of an update about our website and a couple of new cool things which are happening. So there we go. Let's get started with this week's review show. And let's get started with Deceive by Sans Minds. This trick retails at, and I have to look down here, £20.99. So £20.99. Let's cut to a trailer of this product now. Changing the identity of a playing card is a timeless magic effect because it fulfills the inner desire of being able to create a winning hand in the card game. As a magician, we all know one of the strongest things we can do with a deck of cards is to change a card in the spectator's hand. The reactions are insane. However, when we do that, only one spectator feels the most impact. What if we told you that for the very first time, you can have the best of both worlds? Here at the Sands Minds Creative Lab, we have come up with a revolutionary in the spectator's hand color change. Oh, oh, God. God. Not only does the whole crowd get to enjoy the amazing visual of the trick, but the participant feels the magic in their hand. What? <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, no. The best part? is that you end completely clean with the card never leaving their hand. This is the scene. Okay, I'm back. That is Deceive by Sans Minds. And I would like to give you my honest opinions on this product. I open it up, I had a good look through it. You get, of course, the DVD and you get the infamous gimmicks inside. Now, let's have a look at the back, because this is something I've not looked at, is the back of the case. Uh, the skill level required. It's saying three and a half. I would say that's pretty accurate. Uh, audience management, we have three out of five. I would say, yep. There is a little bit of audience management in terms of getting them to be in the correct positioning, the correct lighting, of course, which seems to be a very prominent thing with Sans Minds. The correct lighting, yes. And 180 degrees performance angle. So you are covered in most angles and most performances you would get away with this. However, of course, the lighting does come into play, which I'll bring into. Reset time is instant, and that is a good point. And it's a gimmick that you have to put together yourself. Simple as that. You put together the gimmick and it comes with what you require to make that gimmick except for the playing cards. So you need to add your own playing cards. You might need a couple of dupes. That's all I'm going to say. You have to do a bit of arts and crafts. You have to make it. Don't be put off by that. The making is relatively easy, even though there is a splitting of cards and magic and all sorts of mayhem going on. That's all I'm going to say. I think we know that stuff goes on uh, who are watching the reviews that a lot of the Sans Minds products, some of them come ready to go out the box and some of them you have to put in the time. And there's no way I'd, what I've just said will give away anything. However, you have there's a, there's a bit of making involved. It won't take you long. It'll take you about... Take about 15 minutes, I reckon, on your first gimmick, maybe 20. Of course, if you're young and you're buying this, you need your adult supervision to be using X-Acto knives and all that kind of thing. That's what we always say. But 
Overall, you get what you need into it and great tutorials, and the tutorials are good. You know, he teaches you very step by step how to produce, how to make the gimmick, and how to make it work really well for you. Now, here is my gripe with the product. Is it a worker? Okay, I could see it could be a worker. I could see it could work in most situations. However, there is a lighting problem, and the lighting problem quite simply comes down to, yeah, don't perform in really bright lights like this, even in the tutorials that he mentions that it has to put a flash thing up saying uh, you will be able to see things under these bright lights. Make sure you do it under soft lights, this, this, or in your shadow. Oh, for crying out loud. I don't want to have to be worrying about shadows and, and lights too much, you know. I worry about that with thread work, but not with the cards. So, although it's a, it's a lovely gimmick, and I think there's a lot of thought that's gone into this product, in terms of the lighting, yeah, I am restricted somewhat. Does that mean it's a bad product? No, it doesn't. It means, quite simply, that if you're the kind of guy that does these tricks in the pub and you want to have a cool little trick to perform someone, and, you know, it's one of those self-working tricks that just kind of does itself. There's no, not very much skill involved. There's a little bit of management, but the actual point where it changes kind of happens itself. And that part itself is very, very nice. The gimmick is different. I don't think I've seen this one before. However, you never know. It might be in an old book somewhere. Uh, who knows? That's where most magic comes from. However, I, I personally have not seen this before. And in terms of the change, would I get away with it in a working situation? Okay. Bright lit weddings. No, I don't think I'd be doing it there. However, if I'm, like I say, out in the town or in the pub or in a sort of corporate situation where it's a little bit darker, a little bit cooler, like I was at a, a corporate lodge the other day and it was all really dark lighting and kind of cool ambience, then this will work without question. I think it's a beautiful routine, but I wish that I could, I could do my ambitious card routine and end with this clearly, easily at the very end. And because similar cards being used throughout, I don't think I'd be able to get away with that. Uh, I'm sure there's a way, but for me personally, I wouldn't want to just do this trick. Does that make sense? I'd like to do something else. I'd like to do a few changes, a few moves, a few things before hitting this trick as a finale, where it actually happens in their hands, which I think is lovely. So that is the ups and the downs to it. Uh, there's always ways, I'm sure there's routine you can come up with that would allow you to uh, integrate a different trick into it. However, you know, if, you're, if you've made the gimmick for one set of people, then you're going to have to move around to others. Um, but all in all, I think you'd get away with it. You know, you, it does have... It's something that, because of the way it's made, it could be brought in, taken out very, very easily. And it's not the same dupes as their chosen card, but it's enough to cause a bit of suspicion, I think. So that's all I'm going to say. Apart from that, it's a great trick. It does work, and I think I would use it in the right situation. I think there's not many tricks where the magic happens in their hands visually, and that is where they are right. In that, in that respect, the visual change of being able to pull up the card and it just changes in their hand is beautiful while they're holding on to it. So, yep, there is management involved. Yep, you're going to have to put a bit of confidence into the trick. The making of the product is easy. And will you be able to perform it in 15, 20 minutes? Probably so if you're medium proficient with cards. If you're not proficient, he goes over all the slights required to achieve the controls and to get ready for the setup of the actual point where it changes. So there it goes. That's my view on Deceive. I know it's kind of up and down with that one. What do I think? I think I would do it. And I do like some of these making gimmicks. I think you just have to be careful about flashing a little bit. However, as he mentioned on the video, is that when you're looking at it from one angle compared to them from this angle, it's very, very different. So from here and behind, you're seeing something a little bit different to what they're seeing. And it does just fly by. So the first part flies by, then after the change, it kind of flies by again, but I would probably feel more comfortable doing a bit of ditching, a bit of magic, Pew, you know what I mean. So there we go, deceive. I'm gonna give this a rating out of 10. So I will give this a rating of seven out of 10. So there we go, seven out of 10 for deceive. I think it will deceive some people and it certainly will get a few really, really, really strong reactions. So there we go. Deceive. Boom. By Sands Mines. That retails at £20.49. 
get it now. Boom! I've got to stop saying boom, that's twice in one minute. Let's move on to product number two. This is Narcissus by Chris Philpot. This retails at £49.99. Let's cut to a trailer of this product now. There are five effects on Narcissus. In each one, the photo of a spectator magically transforms on a borrowed, locked phone. I got this postcard at a museum in Budapest. You hand someone a postcard with a picture of an old fortune-telling machine on one side and a fortune written in Romany on the back. Using their own phone, you film them trying to read the fortune. Do you understand that at all? No, I don't. But when the video is played back, they can read the fortune perfectly. You will meet a pleasure. And Bring a card. the name of a lucky chosen card. <laughs> what the f card. <laughs> wow. You guys like Harry Potter? Yes. Do you remember the spell Aparisium? Aparisium is something that reveals hidden secrets. Do you remember this? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, you ask someone to think of a person, place, or thing. Okay. One, two, three. Then you cast the revealing spell from Harry Potter, which makes their secret thoughts visible. Oh my gosh. Yours says, I am thinking of a table, and yours says, I am thinking of a tool. What the hell? All right, I believe in God. <laughs> what just happened? I believe it. That was crazy. Oh my, oh my gosh, that was awesome. Some people say that fortune telling can be dangerous. I want to see my future. And that's what it says on the card. So you have someone give their yeah, consent to a reading, only to have that consent. Holy shit, what the f What? What the f Reveal their future. What the f Can I post this? Yeah, you can totally post that. The spectator promises to assert their free will and make a free choice. My will is strong, I will make a free choice. But in the end, you've controlled their every decision. Okay, this is weird. You guys are already hypnotized. Finally, there's unhypnotized, a beautiful, empowering effect that will leave your audience feeling wonderful. That is Narcissus, and this I cannot recommend. This, I think, in my opinion, now we're on to the epic part of the review in terms of not me being epic, the actual products. This is fantastic. I cannot big this one up enough, uh, as I will with another one in a moment. I mean, this is phenomenal. And if you are into mentalism, even if you're not into mentalism, this product's for you. Chris Philpot is a very quirky, kind of crazy kind of guy. He's creative, he's a writer, he does all sorts of things. And many times he doesn't think like a magician, he thinks like the spectator. And he's come up with some wonderful things. In the past, 100th Monkey, and this is kind of a similar sort of thing, but now brought into mobile phones. And you can do some amazing tricks where you're taking a photo, dual reality in a way, of something that they're looking at right here. But when in the photo that's taken afterwards, when they look at it, it they see something completely different. And their mind, they don't know if they've been tricked, what it is, if the mind has seen it, if, if it's actually truly a ghost that's come in, if it's the future, what is it? Who knows? To them, this is real magic. And the real magic comes in its simplicity. Now, it comes with two DVDs. Of course, one's in my computer right now. And one of them contains all the instructions for, I think, five or six of the main effects, if not more, actually. Uh, once again, it then goes and has all of the extra files that you get on the DVD, which is worth the money itself. The files contain images, cleverly thought out and placed out things. That's all I'm going to say. You get some lovely postcards, and that's all I'm going to show you of these, but with words and things that people uh, will have to say. They kind of read out what they see on the postcard, and then 
everyone else sees the same things, but when a photograph is taken and they zoom in on that photograph, it says something completely different. It's divined their future. It's told them what the card was. It's done, there's so many different ways you can do this trick. And it's so, so, so cool. It's so cool. The psychological, the subtleties and everything you get on the DVD is amazing. And everything that you've been taught by Chris Philpott is just, he just goes a million steps beyond what you'd expect in terms of quality teaching. And yeah, five new effects from Chris Philpott. Images on a borrowed locked cell phone magically transform. And the beautiful part about this is that you don't have to do anything. I mean, literally, nothing. It, okay, something. But it's the simplest of the things. Uh, you'll be doing this in moments. And it's more about the presentation, more about the acting, more about the fun that you're having with the spectator. And they are the kind of effects that I love. It gets a great reaction and you don't have to be worried about really difficult sleights of hands and moves and look how good I am. It's about them. And yeah, it's freaking brilliant. Um, who's this? Joshua Quinn. We've got Brett Barry, we've got Joe Monty, all these guys saying how amazing it is. It really has brought the 100th monkey, month, blah, 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 100th monkey into a modern close-up sort of an environment because before it was more of a stage effect as well. So this is not just for serious hardcore mentalists. May I just state that? It's not. This is for everybody. This is for even, I would go as far as saying, just going after beginners, beginners to intermediate, you will get a lot from this. You'll learn a lot. But then also going up from that, if you're a professional, you're a seasoned pro, you work around the world, you're on a cruise ship, or wherever you are, this product is for you. It's for everyone. Quite simply because you get so many extra images on the DVD that will fit around your style. And after that, if not, you can easily adapt and make your own. So really, the we're limitless with this. Straight away, I run a printing business, printbymagic.com. Boom. And I'm going to be putting some of these images onto my playing cards for some tricks. And I know that I will be giving out some of these uh, weddings at corporate events and creating really, really nice emotions. So if you bought this and you ever need uh, some of the images placing onto playing cards, with permission, of course, as long as it's all right, then uh, that's what Print by Magic will do. But you have to, of course, bought the product. But um, yeah, imagine you just simply get a playing card and they read something and it says something completely different to what it says the next moment and when the photograph is taken. Then they share that photograph on social media and not that they're sharing you and you get more bookings and boom, you've made your £49.99 back in two minutes. So I would say go out and get this. You're not going to be disappointed. That's all I have to say. Get it. And it's worth every penny of £50. Every single penny. Now, that is that. I will explain one last thing before we go into the wonderful, wonderful product, which is this, and I'll explain that in a moment. So we've just reduced the price of this <clears throat> to the same price that all the other websites are selling it for in the UK. Um, there was a sort of an agreement where all prices were monitored and kept the exact same throughout the UK, all the major magic shops. However, for some reason, we've realized that we're just the last week or so, well, probably longer, I think, been charging a little bit more than some of the others. Um, everything's automated, everything's linked in with, with companies, and a lot of the websites in the UK use the same systems. That's all I'm gonna say. However, we've reduced the price uh, just to match the other competitors. I'm not gonna be uh, outsold in terms of prices. So, but at the same time, we're not gonna be selling things super cheap. We're selling things at the correct retail price. That's what we pride ourselves in for here at Magic World. So if you do, all I'm saying is if you do see a product on our website that is a little bit higher than it should be, please just let me know compared to only the major sites, not eBay, not Amazon or any of that, but compared to other sites, if you do see it a lot cheaper, but you'd like to get it from us, please do get in touch and I will, without question, uh, match and do the price at the best way I can, if it's feasible. Soon, just give you a little update on our website. We have a whole new backend of our website being developed right now for you. A whole new customer service area, which is gonna make ticketing and questions a lot easier. And most importantly, fun. Also, we're gonna add into the My Account section. We've now added points. If you go to any products, you will see all the points that you will get and any bonus points. And those points can be used at the end. So same as many other magic sites, you're getting, um, I think it's 
five points for every pound spent and it tells you how much they're worth but very shortly with our brand new system you'll log in it'll welcome you you can change your profile picture you'll be able to see your orders a little bit like theory 11 an illusionist very clearly very cool and there'll be lots of quirkiness built into the site so that is coming very very soon we are having it all designed and maybe if i show you some of those designs in next week's review show maybe you can help and say well Ah, you know, I am a shopper of magic. This is how I would like it to look. Or can you just change that or do this and explain why? If you're up for doing that, just leave a comment down below. And next week, I will just put a few screenshots, little sneak peeks of what the site looks like. And if you could help, that'd be fantastic. But there we go. That's the main thing I'm saying is that we have this at a, a wonderful price of 49.99, matching all the major UK retailers. And if you ever see it slightly higher than it should be, just give me a quick email. Let me know, please, because we want to be not just great customer service but a good pricing uh, we don't claim to be the pre cheapest but we claim to offer that great service so there we go I've said it let's move on to the final product now this is something I am oh, to say excited about when I received it is an understatement it is something that I've been waiting for for a long time and it's it's almost here mm, I needed that <clears throat> this is Murrayment by Michael Murray. Okay, the ultimate ink transposition effect. Is it ultimate? Yes, it is. Wow, this is so, so ultimate. Forget Egyptian ink. I mean, that was, I'm not sure if this was, it wasn't inspired by that. This just takes it all to a whole new level. Come on. Egyptian ink didn't get the best of reviews around the world, I'm afraid. Sorry, Sans Minds. However, this is kind of like a homage to the quality of what Michael Murray will come up with. And he gave him a few moments messing around with coins and he came up with this. And it's just phenomenal. Let, if we've got a trailer to this, let's cut to it now. Okay, I'm back, and that is Murrayment. It's a very short, very quick clip showing you what Murrayment is. And it's a, a transposition of coins. It retails at £30, which I think is an absolute steal for the gimmick you get and also the DVD. The gimmick will last a lifetime, literally. It'll last a lifetime, and unless you accidentally leave it somewhere, like any coin stuff, uh, coin uniques or whatever, it's yours, it's, it'll last a long time. In terms of they sign a £2 coin, you sign a 10p coin, they suddenly switch places while inside their hands, they now, the coins, they've now signed a completely different coin. They've now signed the 10p coin and you've now signed the £2 coin. It's just the most beautiful transposition you could ever imagine. And without going into any detail or too much detail, that is a £2 coin. And that's all I'm going to show you. A beautiful £2 coin that they've signed now becomes... A Tempe coin that they have signed. So it offers a great opportunity for dual reality. It leaves a great opportunity for various different effects, which you do get on the DVD. You get dual reality sort of uh, extras, you get five routines, four or five, I can't remember exactly, and all the sleights of hand that go along with it. This is something that gets amazing reactions. I did this um, at a wedding last, last week. I've done it on my girlfriend, I've done it to quite a few people since, and it took me, okay, I'll be honest, it took me a little bit of time to get used to a move. You've got a, a, couple of, a couple of basic moves, like the spellbound change and a thumb crutch, you know, holding coins, basic stuff to do. But it's not difficult. Don't be put off by that in any, any way. It is an easy effect to achieve. It's something that you will be doing in, if you've just got into coins and you're getting into it, then you'll still be able to do it. If you're brand new to coins, you will have to put a bit of work in, but it does teach you how to do that very clearly on the DVD. And then it teaches you the other routines as well. 
very well taught, very well thought out, as everything is by Mike Murray. And Michael Murray, it is a brilliant, brilliant thing. The DVD is full, right to the end, of quality information being taught to you. Lots of discussions, lots of ideas. Now, is this something that you would work as a real worker? Well, yes, it is a total real worker. It's one that you can carry in the side of your pocket, it takes up no space whatsoever, and you're ready to go. It's the perfect effect out on a night out, it's the perfect effect anywhere, and it will just slay your audience. This is a pre-order item. Okay, so what I'm saying about this, it's not even available until just after the first of next month. After the first of next month, we will have these bad boys in stock. And I'm going to give this a rating right now out of 10 because this is quite simply, nothing is a 10. And I don't know why I always say that. Nothing is a 10. However, <laughs> in many ways, I'd like to say this is my first 10. I'm going to give it no, I'm not going to quite. I'm going to go 9.5 out of 10. I'm going to say that was amazing. The video teaches you how to do it. it. It's more about the information you're getting on the video and it's about the actual product you get with it and the Michael Murray teaching, it's phenomenal. And for £30, it's one of the, I think probably the trick of the year so far for me, or at least one of the tricks of the year for me, if not the tricks for a few years. So that is that, it's a brilliant product, it's on pre-order and it's available from our site very soon but then only being made in limited quantities they are running out very very fast so if you want one please please do click the pre-order button you will earn points with this and we're going to throw in an extra 100 bonus points for the first for the first few days only just for the first few days we'll throw in 100 bonus points on top of the points you already get for this product simply click the pre-order button the very moment that this is released by michael murray to the world, uh, we will get it in the post to you. And um, before any other, of the, uh, well there's one shop that already does sell this product, they've had an exclusive for a while, but since then, after that, it's gonna be released to the masses. We will get it at the same time as everyone else. We'll make sure we pop it in the post super quick to you. So that is Murray Mint. Get yourself one, you will not be disappointed. I promise you, you have the magic world promise with that one, you will. Laugh, you'll giggle and you'll smile when you see the gimmick, especially when you uh, you see it and view it as a two pound coin, which is just, oh my goodness, beautiful. At the end as well, you do end completely clean. Everything can be examined. They've got their coin, you've got your coin, everything is clean. So there we go, that is Murray Mint. And get yourself one at the link down in the show more section, 30 pounds and uh, yes, uh, there we go, that's the end of the review show. Boom, I can't say any more about it. We've had three good products, um, and I'd say that about all of them. They're all good in their own right. I would say this, if you're gonna get and treat yourself to any products this week, and I, this could be an expensive month for some people, I, I understand that, because this is amazing, and that is amazing, incredible, awesome. That is medium amazing under the right conditions. So there we go. The end of the Magic World Review Show. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope I didn't babble on too much about all this. And uh, we're still hoping to be inside the shop. We didn't manage to start moving last week because of all the uh, mortgages and everything that goes through. They say it'll happen in one day and then it ends up taking two weeks. So we're still waiting for the keys. We're still waiting for that final swap over. Going to be very soon. When we do, we'll do a, a few pictures of before and after. Maybe some 360 shots to show you the new place and uh, how we build it. Maybe even a time lapse. So thanks again for watching the Magic World Review Show. Thanks for all your support. Have a great day. Ciao for now. Hey, I've not done ciao for now in years. Woo! Let's just make sure that I actually hit record on the uh, camera. just want to make sure. Yes, thank goodness I did. Just one more test, yeah. Do, 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 do. That's a bit messy. Do, 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 ch. Don't forget to click subscribe. Click subscribe. 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 Click subscribe. Subscribe to me, subscribe to the channel and have a cup of tea, but it's a coffee.